Hi, my name is Jim and I'm with storagehorse.com. Okay, I'm trying to show you today. We buy uh, storage auction units for a living and um, I'm going to show you the cheapest way we've found to ship an album. Okay, Here's, you take your trusty dusty album. Okay, put that aside for now. Alright, what you need to do is go to your local USPS office, your post office, and get a $14.95 flat rate priority mailbox uh, priority mail box which is free and they look like this and when they're folded out basically it's that type of box okay so what you do is you take that box and you bend the, the tabs a little bit and you want to take your knife you need a box cutter and you're going to cut right down the sides and set those aside cut down both sides Okay, now that you got that done, find the area where the seam is and pull the box apart. Okay, once you have the box apart, what you're going to do is fold it inside out and in half at that point, right on one of these seams. Okay, so once you have that, now basically your box is just about ready. What you're going to do is you're going to put the album inside the box with the open end toward the center fold. Okay, then what you want to do is give yourself about three quarters of an inch and put a little mark there. We're going to cut it. Don't cut the album. All right. And then if you want, you can use another piece of the same cardboard so you don't have to go out and spend money on a level. And you can put that on top of this box, line it up with that little tape line, and cut both. Get rid of that. You're good to go. Now, go ahead and set your album back in. And what you can do, if you want extra support, is take these tabs that you cut off that have the tape. And what you want to do, pop the tape off and stick one, here I'll do like this, stick one on top of the other. And that becomes a nice sturdy support that you can put on one side and then you can take the other and do the same thing. Okay, so that gives you a nice little extra support in there. Then what you got to do is you need a stapler. Now this is the part you have to be really careful. So what I suggest is make sure you can stick your fingers on each side. Make sure your album's in there good and centered. Take your stapler, start here at the center, and just staple the edge. Like no more than a quarter of an inch in. Okay? And then about every three inches, you can put in another staple. Be sure you don't hit the album. And you got to remember inside the album as well, if you're an idiot and you go too far, the album is round, so you probably won't hit it with the staple. Um, so once you get a few staples in there, then you can kind of slide it down at that last part. And if the staple will fit in there. And you have to be very careful with this because if you push down too hard or you have a really weird stapler, you might actually crack the album if you were to touch it. But remember, you got three quarters of an inch all around. So there it is. That's that. Basically take your tape and tape around the edges and you are good to go. That's the cheapest way I know how to ship one without having to spend like a dollar or something for each one of these special pizza boxes. Alright, I'm Jim from Storage Horse. That's your tip of the day. Happy hunting.